the forum of former elected council chairmen known as Algon Emeritus have advised all stakeholders to put their hands on deck for the purpose of governing national development and growth of Nigeria. The pro tem national chairman of the forum, Shoaib Brahim, was speaking in Abuja after the inaugural meeting of the former elected council chairman. Algon is a forum of elected council chairmen across the nation with over 100 members spread across the six geopolitical zones. Ibrahim said the essence of the forum is to find a way to contribute their own quota to national growth and development, saying that all hands must be on deck in every zone of the country with adequate mobilization sufficient for fast and equal growth in all regions. To chairmen and chairpersons who have enjoyed the benefit of grassroots endorsement, we have come together to find a way of contributing our own quota to national growth and development. Concerned about the state of our nation, we are of the view that all hands must be on deck. Every quarter of this country, every strata of the society must be mobilized sufficiently so that we can galvanize to greater cohesion and national development. And we are convinced that having been elected at council level and as grassrooters, grassroots politicians, who believe that every politics is local, we're in a very vantage position to assist in national growth and development if we put our acts together. That is the purpose of this organization and that is one principal objective that we're out here to serve. Today we're batting the existence of uh, a new formidable organization with uh, members all over the country. The people you see here are representative of the six geopolitical zones and uh, in the no distant future you'll be hearing policy statement emanating from this body as our own way of contributing to national growth and development. We're not going to be a body of critics, we're not critics, but we'll be identifying areas that need to be touched by both government and the entire society, the larger society, and not just identifying the problems, we'll be preferring our own alternative ways of uh, resolving some of those issues as shall be raised by us from time to time. That, by way of summary, is the purpose of this gathering, and that, by the grace of God helping us, uh, that's the agenda we tend, I mean, we plan to pursue. Having been elected at the council levels and as a grassroots politician, they believe that every politics is local, noting that through their engagement with local citizens, they are better informed about their plight and will periodically come out with policy statements without criticism, but identifying areas of improvement and immediate attention of government where necessary. Shoaib Ibrahim said all stakeholders in the country can assist in national growth and development if there is unity, which is the purpose and core mandate of the organization. At, at everything has a formative stage. The most beautiful idea in the world today, even if we could talk about democracy, came from one man. It has to start from somewhere. The people you see gathered here today are those who battered this idea. Uh, at, the, at the membership level, our drive, we have well over close to 100 people as I speak, and we are growing. So those you see here are representatives of the geopolitical zone. It is not supposed to be a congress where you have all the members present. We plan that God helping us, our convention or congress shall be in December. That is when you see the entire strength and membership of this organization by His grace. And uh, I, I have no doubt that you know, we have 774 local governments in this country, and several people have served at various status. We, we, we don't have political uh, boundaries. This is made up of both all the principal parties, you know, in this country, whether you call it opposition or the ruling party, but uh, mainly of those who feel concerned about the state of the nation and those who think they have an obligation to come together to also contribute their own quota in helping Nigeria out of the doldrum. It will be idle to pretend that all is well today. Nobody should be saying that. But what is important is how we're able to critique the affairs of the state and also provide solutions so that we can assist the government and indeed the people to move to greater heights.